Hello everyone, this is Gaia Intuitive Tarot. Please like, share and subscribe. And I will be delivering our messages from, for Twin Flames and Soulmates. And I would like you to stay tuned if you're interested, if you're here to find out about your Twin Flame. Please like, share and subscribe. And... You may need to sit down for this, get you a cup of coffee, pause, get you a cup of coffee or your wine or whatever you, or your popcorn or something, your snacks. Guys, um, as I was meditating before your readings, it the messages are popping up again, but I saw, I heard um, that karmic relationships are ending so if you're divine feminine so it could be a divine feminine or divine masculine ticket how it applies the energies can be switched the roles can be switched i feel like the karmic relationships are ending i feel like the divine masculines are realizing that they were in toxic situations they are having an awakening that they are meant to be with the Divine Feminines. I feel like the energy of the karmic has been draining to the Divine Masculine. She could have drove him to do drugs, alcohol, going um, stress. I'm also hearing high blood pressure for some of you. But I feel like now your masculines are tired of this toxicity. And I feel like they've been praying and praying and praying. And now they've finally gained the strength to come out of this. To move on from this toxic relationship and free themselves. I also feel like they were binded by this karmic into this relationship. I feel like this comic, for some of you, they were blackmailed. I feel like there was some information. For some of you, I feel like this female was doing um spells, spell work on the divine masculine to keep him like, you know, to keep him trapped under her, under her command. You know, you know how um, these hoes operate. So I feel like, guys, you know, um, now your divine masculines are woke. They're coming towards you. These comic relationships are ending. I also hear you guys have also been praying, divine feminines. You've been praying. You've been praying for your divine masculine. You've been praying and manifesting. For some of you, you're like, just like your lives, like in general, like you've been manifesting, you're improving you are headed towards the right, the right direction. Your angel number that was channeled was number 1607. So that number is a congrat it's a message of congratulations from your angels, your guides, your ancestors, God. Yes, you name it. It's a message of congratulations that you are headed towards the right direction. And <clears throat> that you will keep improving as long as you hold a positive mindset, a positive thought. You know, as long as you have positive thoughts... You need to use visualization. You need to visualize your success. You need to visualize your goals manifesting. Visualize your goals happening. You need to see it in your mind happening. You also need to say positive affirmations. I am successful. I am love. I am abundant. 
you know, saying like positive affirmations, I am beautiful. I love myself. You know, like saying positive affirmations to build yourself, to uplift your spirit, your soul, yourself. Also, I'm hearing that so some of you you studying like doing research, studying. For some of you, you may need to. You could be Christians. Reading the Bible will be vital for you around this time. For some of you, like reading magazines. I don't know. Whatever you read, like reading books, literature, your favorite book, your favorite um authors, reading their books. Um, for some of you listening to music, lyrics, messages, that's where you also because I feel like that's how you will receive intuitive downloads. But it's also vital for your for you for you for your health, your mental health. It will boost your mental health, and when your mental health, because this number also has to do with like um the intelligence, the brain, the number seven Libra, bad um Libra rules education. That is the house rules the house of education, so institutions. Also, that is why it is vital to. You know, I don't. I'm hearing do research, do some research, history. If you're into history, Libras, um, you may be a Libra. Libras are known for loving history. I'm also hearing um being kind, being generous, being giving, just believing in God, trusting because your angels are around you. That's all you have to know. Whatever you're working on, your businesses. Success. So let's get into your tarot reading. Oh my God, seven seven. You see, if you add sixteen and set oh seven seven seven. They love it in the building. Twin flames. Wow, the love is in reverse. So you are separated from your twin flame. The majority of you, you are separated, and with the high priestess in reverse, I feel like there are some repressed feelings, some things that are some feelings that are not being expressed. But I feel like with the two of wands, secretly the the, the divine masculines they are planning to come forward. Because with the Knight of Cups, they are following their heart and their heart is leading them to their feminine, you. Take it how it applies, switch the roles. If, but I'm, I'm seeing here the Divine Masculine coming towards the Divine Feminine. Because with the Two of Wands, I feel like there were two women, they, he was dealing with two women, first of all. Multiple women for some of you. But I feel like they, you, they could be in their late 20s for some of you. For some of you, you could be in your 60s. For some of you, you could be, um, yeah, you could be 26, 27. But I feel like with the Eight of Wands, the, you guys were separated. You were from a distance. But I feel like it's in reverse now. They're coming to your location. I feel like they're coming to visit you. They don't want to talk over the phone. They don't want to send you an email. They want to see you face to face. So with the Eight of Wands in reverse, they are coming where you are with the Knight of Cups. Coming with this cup, coming with this offer to give it to you in your hand. Face to face. Like, obviously, could be something tangible. They may come with a gift for some of you. But I'm seeing them like coming towards you because you guys were separated for a long time. So they don't want to, they want to man up. They want to man up to what they did. So they want to face you. They want to come to you face to face. They don't want to talk over the phone. So they will come over. I feel like in the next week, in within a week for some of you, for some of you within two weeks, you will hear from this person. The 
king of cups in reverse yes he's not emotionally he's not satisfied he's not happy about this separation he's not happy at all and what he's not telling you is that he's not happy without you that's what he's that is what is being hidden from his side he's not happy without you his heart has turned cold without you because this feminine as i said she was very like she was she had a negative influence on him she was encouraging him to continue like doing negativity to continue drinking to continue doing cocaine to continue doing these drugs all um indulging um in this toxicity toxic lifestyle that they were living together the two of swords in reverse now he knows what what he has to do so that is why he's planning he's no longer in the state of confusion i feel like for some of you he could have quit drugs i feel like he could have um I'm, also he could be um rehabilitating himself or he could be going to actual rehab because i did say um the libra card institution that also rules the rehabs so he could have went to rehab or maybe um he's reading books keeping him busy like to keep him distracted not every time he thinks of a drink he may like read a book like you know he's keeping himself um busy and i feel like with the two of swords he is very informed not right now i feel like he has a lot I feel like his mind, he has a lot in his mind, like a lot of ideas. Because I feel like now he's, I also feel like he's coming up with solutions, how to fix this. Because I feel like with the 12 swords in reverse, this is like obstacles, problems. Now he's coming up with solutions, how to build, how to um fix this, how to come towards you. How to make up for what he did. Page of Wands. He feels free now. And he feels free, but at the same time, he also feels small, you know? Because, you know, also with the King of Cups in reverse, like the, a whole king in reverse, and he's coming up, he's showing up as a knight and a page. He is... He feels more, obviously he will build, he, he's coming to, to this energy, but I feel like he's still like, you know, trying to find himself, like, because he, I feel like he's still like, you know, healing from this. I also feel like with the, with the judgment card, like his judgment, he, at the, he, he feels like you don't want him anymore. That is why he's panicking. I feel like he's also like panicking with the Eight of Wands in reverse. He's panicking. He's having an anxiety. He wants to come towards you, but I feel like he cannot. Well, he can, but he's anxious. He's definitely like coming towards you with the Page of Wands. As I said, he's traveling to come see you. For some of you, you could be, he could be black, he could be dark skin, he could have dreadlocks. For some of you, he may have a gold tooth, he may have like gold in his tooth, but like maybe, um, maybe not too much, but he has a gold in his tooth. For some of you, he likes to wear, um, what do you call that cap? Um, it's not a barret. What do you call that cat, man? Um, oh my God. But he likes to wear a hat, like a head pick, a cap. Um, it looks like, um, it looks, what do you call that cap? Oh my gosh. But yeah, he may like to wear um, a brown, um, he may like to wear a brown jacket. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let me pause. Five five five. 
Oh yeah, so as I was saying, yeah, I was saying he may wear like a brown jacket, so it's like a brown cordial jacket. For some of you, it could be leather, but it has um that sheep fur. It may have like white fur, like sheep fur, like inside. Like it may even like come outside, like here um in the wrist area, like in the um yeah. Yeah, that cap that I was talking about, that it's a vintage, it's that vintage cap, that retro hat, that retro cap. So like, yeah, he may wear one of, he may like to wear one of those for some of you. Oh, and goes on. Yeah, so like, um... Yeah, he may wear, he may like to wear that. For some of you, he may like to um wear um baggy jeans. As I said, like for some of you, I'm talking to like I'm talking to like the black people, like the black community. For some of you, even like I don't know, do like white men usually like wear baggy what jeans? Queen of Cups in reverse. I'm not sure if that popped out correctly. I think it was interfered. Um, clarify. Um, Archangel Metatron. Clarify um, the Knight of Cups and the Eight of Wands. Angel Metatron. Oh, the Two of Cups. Yes, he wants to meet like face to face. He doesn't want to talk over the phone. So he may like in. Oh yeah, as I said, so he may call you out on a date. So like, so he may like organize like a dinner for two, like here with the Two of Cups, and like he may like get it going so like he may start like talking like sharing um um he may start like sharing his thoughts like his emotions how it feels um and also like apologize because that's also what he's like planning because he doesn't want his apology to come half ass like he wants to um apologize like a real man like with no ego like it's it's really difficult for men to apologize, so that is why it's taking him like he's taking like his time to like plan like, okay, what am I actually gonna say? Um. So. He doesn't just wanna come and just like give you like a simple I'm sorry. He also wants to explain. He wanna explain like what went down. Like he and he wants you to to know that he 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 knows that what he did was wrong. He knows he wants you to know that he he wants you to know that he, he knows that he made a mistake. But here with the two of cups, I feel like you are both. I feel like you also want him back. Majority of you, if you clicked on this video. You clicked because, I mean, why would you care if you don't want him back? So, with the Twelve Cups, this is like neutral energy. You both want this. So, don't be, <laughs> so don't be like, um, you know, like in the comments, like, um, nah, I don't want him. You can, he, then don't watch if you don't want him back. But majority of you, you guys, like, you definitely want him back. Like, here yeah, with the Empress card. So some of you, you may have um, children with this person, like you may have children, for some of you may have like two children, for some of you, you may have like, um, yeah, heavy emphasis on two children, for some of you, you may have twins, if it's not twins, it's just like two children, page of wands and so they could be both fire signs. You may have like two children, fire signs. The other one is probably um in Aries. The other one is probably um a Sagittarius. 
fair enough. If not a Sagittarius, it could be, um, yeah, Sagittarius. Or it could be a Gemini, because I'm getting like strong twin energy here. So you may have like two children, fire sign and an air sign, a Gemini and a Aries or a water sign even, a mm -hmm. Pisces, a Gemini and a Pisces or a Scorpio. But I feel like here with the Seven of Cups, for some of you, you could be um pregnant. You could be like seven months pregnant and... The father of your child is like out there in the streets like and you're like two months away from giving birth like seven months pregnant and he's out there like in the streets like literally here with the two of cups you're too they love it in a belly oh my god jesus christ lord have mercy i do this for a living y'all <laughs> yeah you're pregnant and the father of your child is like out there in the streets. But I feel like here with the um with the four of cups. I feel like he's gonna have a tall moment. He's gonna wake up, he's gonna have like a rude awakening. Let him play, let him, don't stress yourself, like, enjoy your pregnancy, you shouldn't be stressing. He's gonna have, like, a rude awakening, like, <laughs> God is gonna show him, like, what's up, like, he's gonna show him, like, what's up, what's, what's good, you know what I'm saying? So, with the Six of Cups in reverse, for some of you, I feel like you, you don't, um, Six of Cups in reverse and the, um, the Emperor card, for some of you, um, you were like, you were, um, your masculines were very abusive, very controlling with the Emperor card. Like, they were like, they could have been, um, misogynists too. So I feel like with the Six of Cups in reverse, you don't want them back. Like, like you're legit moving forward. If you're moving forward, you will meet somebody new who's going to love you. Somebody who's going to, um treat you like an equal with the two of cups somebody who's not going to treat you as inferior because here with the empress like you have the empress in the upright and this person is the emperor in the reverse so this is not an ideal husband or soulmate somebody that you want to spend the rest of your life with they have to work on themselves for some of you, I feel like this could be, um, you could be have like memories in the past, like maybe like they were abusive. So where am, so where am I going with this? So for some of you, you could be dealing like with the cancer here. So you could be dealing like with the cancer. So yeah, for some of you, this is definitely like a cancer coming towards you. some of you i feel like they could be like working on their finances because i feel like they're trying to be um regain like their independence because i feel like for some of you this person like they lost everything because of this karmic right 
So this woman, as I said, she encouraged him to continue drinking, continue like doing these drugs, continue like indulging in, in like this toxic lifestyle that she's le leading him to this like dark path that she was like leading him into um, depth. So I feel like he's like trying, so here with the Eight of Pentacles, he's working again towards like this Nine of Pentacles. He's trying to get there. And I feel like he's one pentacle away from there because I feel like he's focused. Like he's really focused right now. He's, I feel like he, now he, um, for some of you, you could be dealing with the Virgo. Heavy emphasis on Virgo here with the Eight of Pentacles and the Nine of Pentacles. Yes, yeah, Seven of Swords and the Knight of Swords. So I feel like they're um, strategizing here with the Eight of Pentacles and the Seven of Swords, like um, working out, as I said, like they were planning something here. They were working something out. But I feel like, I don't know why, I feel like with the Seven of Swords, this person is like, for some of you, if you're dealing with an S sign, I feel like this person is just like deceptive. Because I feel like they are coming in like a thief in the night. Like, I don't like the, the way they come in. It's like, you know how somebody like comes back in, like they act like nothing happened. Like they expect you to, to like sweep things under the rug. Like, it's like if they, when they find, you should also be fine. If they're not fine, then don't be fine. If they find again, then be fine again. You know, this is that kind of person. You could be dealing with a Gemini or an Aquarius, like somebody who's just hot and cold. So I feel like now they're coming back like a thief, like with the Knight of Swords. Like, yeah, these people, they're just like, it's just like knights and um, pages coming here and the counterfeit emperor. But I feel like with the moon card, as I said, like your intuitive... Um, your intuitive abilities, your intuitive gifts, I feel like it's, um, as I said, from that angel number 1607, like you're working on your, um, actually they are improving, like reading, you, it's important for you to read, as I said, if you're a Christian, read the Bible a lot, it's going to be vital for you, or read a magazine, read newspaper articles, what's on the news, Go online, do some research. If you're into history, do some history research. Like, like engage your mind. Like, like you need to work. You need to keep your mind busy. Like, you can't keep like staying like thinking about somebody who's out there like playing. Like, you need to focus on yourself. If somebody is being selfish and focusing on themselves, you do the same. You focus on yourself. You don't. You don't run. Like, you, you never see, a, like, a female lioness chasing a male lioness. Like, that's bizarre in nature. So, don't chase him. He, he should be the one who's doing the hunting because a man is supposed to hunt because they're, the, they're hunting to find a woman who's going to um, take care of their legacy. You know what I'm saying? So, you shouldn't be the one, like, doing the hunting he should hunt for you he should go and find you which is why he's coming towards to find you so here with the empress this is basically like telling you like all you have to do is sit and do nothing don't lift a finger you don't have to lift a finger like you don't even have to jump when you receive like a notification from his um like a message coming from him but i don't feel like he will send you a message i feel like he will come face to face but some of you you better be careful if you did not change like um residence you know people change locations you know what i'm saying you're not a tree you're a human so yes you are bound to travel and move but I feel like, yeah, with the, um, anyways, I think we should, uh, I should put this card, 
y'all i haven't pulled a lot of cards and i've said a lot we are already 30 minutes in so yeah the world card fulfillment so for some of you i feel like this is like a cycle that is meant to be completed for some of you you're definitely like meeting um somebody new with the world card for some of you i'm hearing um so this could be like a proposal right with the world card because with the empress card and the um seven of cups he's thinking about making you like his woman right he wants you to be his woman he wants you to be his wife like the empress you marry the empress if it's not the queen of pentacles it's the empress who else so with the world card for some of you i definitely feel like as i said you you could have switched locations with the world card you could have traveled like you're somewhere else there was a reading, one of the signs that I did. It was Aquarius. <clears throat> Beloved in a building. Heavy emphasis on the throat chakra. Could be dealing with a Gemini or a Taurus. So you could be the Gemini or the Taurus. So... What was I saying? Oh my god. Yo, what was I saying? But yeah, I was oh yeah, I was talking about an Aquarius reading. So it could be an Aquarius. So I feel like this person like definitely like you you switch locations. If you're an Aquarius, you definitely switch locations. I mean, not all of you, but there's an Aquarius here that switched locations. So, maybe that's when this person will call you. Hence, the Five of Pentacles. For some of you, like, you traveled across a body of water. Like, you, you could have moved, like, overseas for some of you. But for some of you, you could have, like, switched, like, states. You moved into another state. Or another province. Oh, Lord. Have mercy. Lord, have mercy. For some of you, you could be, like, listening to a lot of music. A lot of um, music from the 80s. Yeah, with the devil card and the empress in... The and temperance in reverse <sighs> there could be a Virgo here a Virgo female that is like doing spell work like if you're an Aquarius there's a Virgo female here they could be working with a Capricorn but a Capricorn and the Sagittarius so they could be working in threes could be a Virgo but there's a Virgo here who's working against um, this Aquarius. Yeah. There could be a Capricorn male. A, um, there could be a Sagittarius male, a Capricorn male, a Virgo female. But I'm seeing a Virgo female, an Earth female, an Earth male, and a male, or male um, Sagittarius. Yeah, they're doing work. They wanna um because you have the King of Pentacles, so they 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 are jealous that you um you found like your husband is as wealth, basically um King of Pentacles. This is like self made. Well, Seven's is my Seven's is. So like this is like self-made with the King of Pentacles.